I was, uh, cycling a bike, cycling a bike into the police station, and obviously I wasn't wearing a helmet, I'm Irish, right, it's already hot here, right, so I wasn't going to put a hat on, so I wasn't going to wear a jacket either, right, or knee pads, right, <laughs> to never cr I'm 35, I've never crashed a bike, like, I've never hurt, and I was just cycling down, enjoying myself, letting my long blonde hair flow on the wind, <laughs> like, tangled sunbeams of gold, having the time of my life when I hear from across the road outside Hindley Police Station, HEY! Where's your fucking helmet, mate? <laughs> I'm a copper! I nearly fell off my bike. Which would have been terrible because I wasn't wearing a helmet. <laughs> and, I mean, if that's how your cops sound, how do your criminals sound? <laughs> Good morning, Chopper. Would you like some lemonade? <laughs> and then we can discuss how we can protect the peace today. Shut up in there! I'll put a taser in your ass! I'm a copper! <laughs> and, 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 and then somebody explained to me, no way, the reason you get fined when you don't wear your helmet is because if you injure yourself, you go to the, the state hospital and it gets paid for you. And I was like, no, but you can't punish me for being a victim. That may never even happen. Look, that's, I mean, you can't just go fining women for wearing dresses. That's not reasonable. You can't, can't behave like that. And then I looked into it in Brisbane. Check this out. Some dude, <laughs> he left his window open four centimeters, goes away for an hour, comes back, and he gets fined $44. That is like $11 per centimeter. <laughs> and the reason he was fined was because he's inciting crime, encouraging the possibility of a crime happening. No, if anybody's encouraging a crime happening, it's the guy giving him the fine, because he's increasing the chance of a fucking murder happening. <laughs> <laughs> and then I found out, I looked into it, I, I, in Melbourne, you guys need a permit for a picnic. <laughs> <laughs> did, you, did you know that? No, you need a, you're not allowed to have a picnic here without a permit. Now, I looked into it, because first, because then I was thinking, I was thinking like, what, really, I'm going to go for a picnic, and what, someone's going to come over, like a cop's going to come over and go, hey, you with the basket, <laughs> have you got a permit? No, oh, I haven't got a, haven't got a permit, man, I'm just having a picnic. In our authorised picnic, get on the ground, get on the ground. <laughs> I'm already on the ground. <laughs>